Hello and welcome to Nairobi Luxury Homes. I am Angie and I'll be taking you through a tour of this amazing townhouse in Karen. The specs on the house are that it's 10,000 square feet of living space. We have a private pool, five bedrooms all en suite. We have a massive backyard, maybe the best I've ever seen. And I've seen a lot of backyards. We have like some immaculate landscaping. I mean, the house is just to die for. So make sure you watch this video to the end. The house is listed for 160 million Kenya shillings. So if you're interested, call me and let me know. So let's start the tour. This is a spectacular development. We have a total of five townhouses and each sits on an acre, like I said. So every single one of the townhouses has its own private little entryway here that we have um, cabro paved with the different colors. There's a gray and a red and a off, um, like a white wash or a stone wash color. And there's also a two door garage. You can comfortably fit, uh, I want to say 12 to 15 cars here. So uh, having guests is not an issue. Also, if you have a massive fleet of cars that you call your own, that is also a plus. So as we walk into the house, there's this massive entrance here with the wooden doors that are covered in veneer and this magnificent foyer with the spiral staircase. I love how they used these windows on top of the door that just allow in all this natural lighting, makes it feel quite cozy and bright and absolutely airy. As we come down this way, we are going to take two steps down into the sunken living room. Uh, I love the wooden floors. They make our home really warm and cozy as opposed to just having it tiled all over. So I love that little touch. We have some wall, some light fixtures here, wall sconces, uh, the, the LED strip lights all over the ceilings. I mean, every light fixture here just is working together to make the home an absolute masterpiece. We have a space here that could be your second living room, your extra, like your, a, a kid's playroom. It really could be anything on this end here. Some of you might decide to make this your dining room. It's really up to you. And all of these rooms lead directly into your backyard, which is massive. And we're going to get, that, get to that in a bit. So as we walk this way, we walk up again towards what I think should be the dining room. This is the dining room and oh my god, the fact that it leads directly into your pool and we have these sliding doors that can not entirely pocket but will, that will stack and give you this completely flawless look, uh, flawless, you know, like flow into the outdoors is absolutely amazing. We'll get to the backyard in a bit. Don't show them that yet. For now, let's go into the kitchen. This is the kitchen and it's absolutely gorgeous. There's uh, white uh, glossy finishes with the, oh, they actually are a little bit glittery. If you can get, if, I'll try and get a close up of that for you. So we have plenty of, sp of storage space your space here for your side-by-side -side fridge. We have more storage space there. Uh, another extra thing that I really liked about the kitchen was that the island, as opposed to just being one long island, has some cabinets underneath. Everything here is soft clothes and that just makes for a more clean and perfect kitchen. We have a double sink on this end and your extractor on that end. Uh, we have some translucent glass finishes here as well. This door from the kitchen leads out to the DSQ area. 
the laundry area, everything here is just massive, massive, massive. It's quite spacious here. We have two SQs on that end and uh, a door on this other end that leads to the garage. As we walk down the hallway from the kitchen and the dining area, we have the living room on my left and the foyer on my right. And on this end, we have the office space. This space is so conveniently made for an office because it's on the ground floor. We ha it's set apart from the living room. We have all these shelves and cabinets. And it could also be an extra guest room, just in case you need it. So we're back in the foyer and we're going to walk up towards the second level of the house, which is where we have the master bedroom, uh, two extra bedrooms and a massive balcony. I can't wait for you guys to see this. Now we're on the second level of the house. The view from here is absolutely stunning. I love it so much. Obsessed with those windows right there. And this bedroom here is the master bedroom. On this end, we have the closet with plenty of, of uh, wardrobe space. We have a lot of shelves, a lot of drawers. We also have a little vanity on this end of the closet. Right across from the master closet is the master bathroom that they have done in brown marble tiling. It looks absolutely gorgeous. We have some space here to store your towels. On this side, we have a double sink, his and hers. A massive mirror on the wall which I absolutely love and this when I tell you that this is a huge tub it's so big you could comfortably fit two people <laughs> I mean that doesn't make sense but two people could fit in there comfortably on this end we have the shower cubicle and uh, two water closets his and hers again they really thought of everything as they were doing this um, I applaud them for that and yeah as we walk further into the master bedroom I love the detailing in this room there's plenty of sockets the house also comes cable ready we have sockets on this end on that end this is the wall intended to be your headboard but I also love what they did on this other side and they it allows you to you know play around with the positioning of your bed but ideally your bed would be located here with your TV on that end the other special thing about the master bedroom is that it comes with its own spacious balcony overlooking the rest of the development which is your acre of land 
absolutely gorgeous. The trees here are already mature and definitely the lawn could be, you know, manicured to look better. You could throw parties here, weddings here. Like the possibilities are endless just because the space is massive. On this other side, the balcony is still private because that is a window to the master bathroom. And we have two other bedrooms all the bedrooms in this house are en suite so each has a, a shower cubicle and a bathtub I just wanted to point that out on this end we have the second living room or the TV room or the family room this one comes with a little kitchenette here again there's a lot of sockets in this house which is just a plus always a plus to have extra sockets we have a sink here just a little convenient kitchenette for you to use while you're in your family room as we go up these stairs we'll be going up towards the gym so on the third level of the house we have a sauna tub not the traditional saunas with the wooden finishes and everything this is a more modern one there's also a sink and a water closet on that in that room but as, as we walk this way we come into the gym this is a massive gym this detail is i think one of my favorite features of this house the fact that you can overlook the foyer your beautiful staircase the entrance the car paving the car paved parking outside just, just gorgeous just gorgeous and then as we go this way we go outside towards the balcony if i could manage to get this open <laughs> We go towards the balcony into the beauty that is your backyard. It's so quiet and peaceful here. Someone is mowing the lawn for now, so don't mind the noise. But it's absolutely gorgeous. Speaking of the lawn, let's go and see my favorite part, the backyard. I told you I'm obsessed with this backyard we're about to find out why I mean wow <laughs> look at the space here every time house like I said is set on an acre of land 
the grass is well manicured or will be you know as soon as <laughs> they're done with the work on this end we have the pool and there's a detail here that i want to point out aside from the fact that they've already you know done the lighting on the floor it's going to look absolutely gorgeous at night these are this is not wood it looks like wood but it's actually not it's concrete and then they've added some four like four wood tiling which means it's just that much less maintenance the pool is massive i love the contrast of the brown and the white and the house from this angle is absolutely gorgeous everything just came together really well the wooden finishes on the windows plus the stone clad finishes on these pillars the again the four wood finishes on the uh, the pool tiling once you add your day beds here it's just going to be an absolute vibe absolutely i'm, I'm just i'm in awe this is an entertainer's dream this house is an entertainer's dream so you definitely want to call this home if you're an entertainer if you have guests all the time even if you have like a large family even a small one basically this is just perfect the other thing i really like about this uh, backyard is the size of it an acre so you have all this space you can throw weddings big functions you like you literally will never have to pay for grounds for the rest of your life if you own this home everything you need is in here the landscaping is going to be gorgeous once it's fully um, developed once every tree has grown and all of that i can see a whole play area over there for your kids yes yeah. <laughs> you could even have a whole water park in your backyard if you want and that is the beauty of this home is the size of it aside from just the magnificent um, architecture that we have here much for joining us this has been an absolute pleasure to be able to bring you this home if you're interested i'm going to leave my number down below call me and we can come and i could show you around and um, yeah if you if you like the video be sure to leave a, a thumbs up comment share the video with your friends your family anyone you think might be interested in this home and also be sure to subscribe to our channel for these types of homes in Nairobi and maybe sometimes outside or I don't know we might or may not leave the county but be sure to subscribe for more thank you so much and goodbye